Austrians annoy me. Their constant attempts to break the siege of Montua had to be stopped. I had to intercept the Austrians in open battle. Now, even after I have beaten them, more is needed. Here at Arcole, I will lead the army across the Alpone River and through the Austrian lines. Welcome everyone to Napoleon Total War's historical battles, the Battle of Arcole. And after the weird sudden victory of Lodi, we're going to be going this time properly. The, the morale system throughout Total War is always a little bit different, so it kind of caught me off guard a fair bit that we suddenly won. But I think this one should be a little bit nicer and a little bit easier to predict. The enemy is split. We have some enemies over here set up a small detachment. If I'm looking at the map right, it's hard to convey the strategic map screen to what's actually on the battlefield. But over here, we have some enemies and we should have a main force by the other the other bridge. What I'm hoping is there's a few fjords we can use to get over, otherwise bridge battles are not nice. Let's see what Napoleon has to say. Today is November 15th, 1796. I have chosen the site of battle to prevent the Austrians from concentrating their superior numbers against my forces. My plan is to capture the town of Arcol in order to threaten their lines of supply. The main body of the Austrian army under Albinzi, to the northwest at Belfiore, will attempt to relieve Arcole. I know that the marshy ground between the French and Austrian positions will limit the size of force Albinzi can bring against me. We must capture Arcole in the east to carry the day. At the same time, I must resist pressure from the Austrians to the west. We must resist the west and march upon the east. Oh, there, there is not. There is not. Damn it, that's a fjord. We could have used that. Okay, we're just going to have to get moving and do this the old-fashioned way. Rather unfortunately. Is it really bad? I'm tempted to actually hold back here and let the enemy come to us because we could actually win that just from smashing them from afar. Right, cannon-wise, they do have a cannon over there. Law citizen. Damn it, it's basic. Right, I was hoping that would be horse artillery so we can get it moving a bit faster. Napoleon? Get behind the hill. What do we have? We have grenadiers. We have grenadiers and revolutionary. That is it. Oh, we do have some tasty little skirmish units. Right, let's get you guys set up. And I would love to mix these. I want Grenadier and Revolutionary. Right, so that's a good frontage, along with a little bit in reserve, just in case we need it. We we do have means to come over here. We could engage the enemy, but it, it suggests not putting pressure on the West. But let's try this as they suggest. And we'll see how this goes. Um, no, I do. I do want you up front because I, I want to use canister shot eventually. That's <laughs> what it's always about. Just canister everything. Uh, you guys in position. Come on. You're very, very close. Ooh, I might spread you out a bit more because that cannon looks pretty nasty in front of you. Yep, they are firing. Gentlemen, I believe the technical term is get a bloody mush on. Right, I need to go forward a little more. The horses are in place, but these cannons are just a little bit too high. So we need them over this ridge, over the crest of the hill. Keep going. The arrows count as the cav. I've got to remember that. Right, speed up. And we are ready. Once they set their position proper, do it. Right, we're going to get firing on this. We're going to knock out their cannon as quickly as we can. And I'm going to see if we start poking the... Oh, no, they're coming to us. Oh, yes. Cheeky shots, gentlemen. Chasseur. Doing their thing. Oh, that's mighty. 
Are you firing yet? Here you go, go on. Hurry up. Oh, bugger. <laughs> Starting to get more and more of our infantry at this. That's not good. Right, once the cannon's in, we're going to pull these guys back a bit so we can get canister fire over onto them. How are the shots over here? Feeling them? A ah, little high, gents. little high. If you get a barrage on, we're just going very fast. Constant hits. Who can reload quicker? Ooh, you were so close. You were so bloody close. Ooh, have we got one? We got one! <laughs> Literally one! <laughs> he just freaking stood back up. Dude, that guy's a boss. He got cannon to the face. Alright, we we'll grab you two. Get you pulling back. Alright, I heard the chasseurs already. I think I need to be. Watch the little sprites run away. Right, cannon, you have set up. I should be expecting canister shot flying in now. Actually, found this one. They're already starting to break. I would like to see them do so. Nice. Nice. Oh, I do love canister. I want to see if we had some howitzers. I think that would just make my day. Right, they're going to bring their forces in. I really don't mind that. I actually feel like holding this would have been the better idea for winning this match anyway. Come on, be absolutely honest. All right, change target. Oh, perfect timing. Let's barrage them as well. We want nice quick fire just deleting this. And I'm going to try and get this cannon a little bit further up to try and take them on. Ooh. They are definitely pulling back. What are you doing? We've destroyed one cannon. Damn. Could you please fire more? Ooh, excellent. All right, let's go big. Let's take on the general. General snipe. Nice. How is that shot? That doesn't look that great. I think I'm bouncing. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not liking that so much. All right, let's move them. Let's move them around this side. So they can also be firing over the bridge. All these reinforcements ready to go as well. Ow. Nice, get a volley. Shuffle forward. Yeah, that's a terrible position because they're firing directly through us. Second shot. Oh, crap. No, don't do it. Don't do it. Do it when we tell you. Yep. Oh, bugger. That's big hits. Come on, guys. I need you to smash this. I want to bring it over there, but it's very, very dangerous. I don't know where to put them. I really don't. I think we have to bring it over here. And we'll get ready, because we might end up having to run. Run from this position. But I feel like we should be able to clip anything coming in. So I do want to get those last few hits. Ow. Come on. Bring the cannon in. Let's 
this unit doing? Are they going to try and move through us? Holy smokes, I think they are. French revolutionaries. Excellent. And the enemy general. Oh, that's perfect. Oh, big hits coming in from everywhere. Nice. Right, could you give me... Big shots. Excellent. Oh, one left. Two left, sorry. Two cannon, and we're done. Come on, guys. You can do this. You want the bullions? The ultimate artillery general. shots coming in that should be able to do something I mean this is a fair sacrifice we've knocked out what one two three four units in moving through here got rid of most of their cannon we now have a cannon in position I just would have loved would have loved to have taken this out a bit faster Come on, guys. You're, you're going through marshy land, so this is really slow on this end. Right, I'm going to cook you guys for just a little bit more. Right, just the one. A little bit of an angle on there as well. If any of this survives, I will be amazed. But uh, it'll do the job. They've done the job. If, I don't think you will, but if by some miracle we can fire on this as well. Just get rid of the last of it. We should be seeing some cheeky shots over here as well. Because it looks like the enemy wants to go and reinforce. Yes, they do. Oh, bugger. Nope, maintain that. I'm going to bring you up to that ridge and start firing over. You can stop getting shot from that flank. In fact, I think you are going to come over here. You're going to get ready to take on this infantry, whatever makes it into you. Right, there we go. We've got Chasseur, Revolutionary, and a Grenadier preparing to take them on. Enemy cannon should only be taken out like one each time now. What is our range? We can potentially, if we get a little bit closer, start clipping over the bridge. We've got one more cannon to deal with, and then they have no artillery. That's been a massive waste of our... Our cannon, though, has gone on for a bloody while. Ooh, they're out. They are out. We need to send someone else in to keep our artillery covered. Mm, might need to send some more units. Reinforcements. I'm going to send you out over here. Deal with the units. We've done exactly what we're not supposed to do. Right, that's fine. <laughs> oh, you bugger. Right, I think you can get in a better position to take them on. And you guys can run away. Flee, flee. Oh, I wanted to square them up. Can you grenade? I think you can grenade. Quick grenade. Excellent. I'll take that as a cheeky little grenade shot. Yes, 
Yeah. Square up. <laughs> Not that it'll do much, but hopefully that'll help them just fight it out. Tank it till the end. It does mean we have no artillery support on this flank. So, actually, you know what? No, I'm going to get you guys set up there. I'm moving this unit down. Because it's, it's getting some good hits, but... A little bit of cannon fire over here. That'll truly do the trick. Alright, let's move you forward a touch. A spell. Where's, um, I feel like I'm going to be in range if I move them over here, but I kind of feel like we have to just to get them you know, in that better position. We've actually wiped out the enemy's reinforcements pretty much at this point. That's, that's not bad. <laughs> that's not bad at all. Oh, excellent. Uh, you guys, um, you're gonna have to slink your way over here. We'll bring them this way so they can help deal with canister shot from this flank. And grenadiers are holding. Just, let's be in a better position. Get that nice solid hit against the enemy. Almost gone. Cannon. I'm gonna be a bit risky with ya. No, I'm not. I'm gonna come down here, then I'm gonna come up. Yeah. Okay, your grenadiers. There's not many of you left. Get in there. <laughs> Just get in there. Damn it. Cast you all. Don't even need to go that far. Just come up here. Yep, you come down. Oh, we've done well. See, the cool thing is, actually, we can sit back and hammer away at them now. Grenadiers are out. I think all of them are out. Right. Stop. F. Fire. Looks like we just had a, a morale problem come in. Too many fallen. Let's see if we can get these guys in place. It's um, a little bit doubtful, actually. Hold there. Get firing. There's still two units left. But we've we've dealt with so two units left. All from the west. The name of Napoleon, the glory of France. Go forth and hold your position. All right, if we can right up to this edge. We might just be in line for canister while remaining outside of their their range. I don't feel great about it. Where, where else can we go? It's a little bit over. Tiny bit of a ridge there. Well, these German fusiliers Ooh. That's not pretty. Come off that. Grenadiers just about holding. Better morale than most units, so we'll take it. Let's speed this up. We want to get cannons into place. Yeah, just having a grand old time. Hello. Have you met our canisters? Oh my god, they're in range. 
Oh, yes. Come on. Please. Please fire. Please be good. We have to inch you forward again. Crap. I think they're coming over. Right. If they do, we're going to have two for two. I think we might have to come over. That barely clipped them. What's it hitting against? It's this bloody ridge, isn't it? No, it's just long range. Okay. That is the slight issue with canister. Really is designed for like super close. Let's see if we can inch it forward. <laughs> We're gonna run out of time. We've only got 15 minutes left. I just realized that we have a time limit. Ooh. You could just go tiniest bit forward. Go on. Yeah, there you go. Right, then set up. Quick shots, lads. We need lots and lots coming in and just hammering these. The quicker we get through them, we can actually engage. They have a real thing for taking on the flank. I don't really know what the idea behind it is, but it's the same thing in Empire. The canister shot will go along an edge rather than through the middle, breaking up unit coherency. I'm wondering if they did that as a balancing thing, just basically just to stop you from breaking unit coherency and getting an insane amount of slaughter in because hot damn it does good right, I'm gonna try and get this right up to that edge they should fire on us Change target. All right, you stop there. Already tagging to take a little bit of a pot shot at you. Come on, get set up. Hello, they've taken over the building. Go on, fire at that. <laughs> fire at that, demolish it. Right, target is just behind them. Yeah, nice. So we're destroying both of them, getting some clip damage in. Right, this is coming in. Gonna come up one side. We're cool with that. Uh, you're actually out of ammunition, so... Yeah, I don't know what I'm going to do with you. I guess I could, like, run them across, maybe? They could be, like, the charge? I mean, how much time we got? When this gets down to 10 minutes, we're going to have to charge across. All right, let's do it at 11. They can take the beating. We'll try and use them as a lure. Like, hello, look at these French revolutionaries. Aren't they just delectable, tasty? You know, you want some. Get them targeted over here. You target just here. Some pot shots. Yep. Just knocking out this side, this flank. We've got 92 there. We haven't actually destroyed that building yet. So let's get on wrecking that again. That works. 
Alright, they're probably going to break pretty damn soon. To a regular shot. Let us inspire the French forces. Oh yeah, they're coming in. Right, you guys. Firing in, knocking out as many of these on the bridge as you can. And then we've got two units coming in to fire as well. Cannon? Pretty damn effective at this point. Like, this is kind of how you want it to go. Lure them across, smash them on the bridge, double canister shot in the face. And as soon as we're done, we can also get all these units pulling back. So we just need to knock out that last unit of fusiliers. Brave men of France. You got this. It's too bad you can't destroy the bridge. It made life a bit easier. Alright, we done over here? We're done over there. Right. Do we want to get these guys charging? I feel like with the last eight minutes, the answer is almost undoubtedly yes. We need to fire just back there, kind of across the unit. Because we managed to knock out another one. So they've only got the one unit of fusiliers and some land there. Well. Can I get you to go and grenade them on a bridge? I feel like that's kind of OP. Yet simultaneously... Sort of hilarious, to be honest. Uh, let's go canister shot as well. I want big shots pounding through this. And I think the general's gone. <laughs> Everything's gone. Oh, I didn't even get to grenade them on the bridge. Why is it grenade them on the bridge? Uh, well, we made our victory. We did exactly what we shouldn't have done and took on the enemy to the west. It didn't really make much of a difference though i mean they just sort of trickled in and then got absolutely annihilated costas are skirmishers but i tell you what they did the bloody job one one unit of grenadiers that's all you need well thank you very much for tuning in for yet another well thank you very much for tuning in for yet another of napoleon's battles as we move across this historical battle campaign for the war on Monday and another little war upon a Sunday. So, if you enjoyed what you've seen and you want to see the rest of it, don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and all that usually be goodness. And of course, till next time, peace out.